Hey guys, welcome back to another set of Pokemon X and Y. Last time, what we did was we went into Parfum, Puff, Parfum Plus, and we we got our things that we needed. And today, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be heading back down Route Six on the sides of Route Six, which are like the sides of Route Six. <laughs> I don't know, dude. We're gonna head down the sides of Route Six with a super tall. Oh, I thought I ran into something, but no, there we go. Oh, we got the sis. And it's night. Gonna head down the sides of Route 6. I, I, I know there's some, some new Pokemon we can catch down here, which is pretty cool. So hopefully we can run into those guys, check what they are, check out what they're like. Maybe catch them if we really... Oh, no, I saw a dude. Oh, there he is. <laughs> maybe catch them if we want to, and uh, also train up our Pokemon. Uh, maybe if we do make it pretty far, we might be able, we might also be able to um, get up to Snorlax or something. I don't know. But uh, yeah, this is the reason why we went up here is because of the Snorlax. And then uh, we got some other stuff, and then I think we'll get to the next town, which is pretty sick. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> thank you everyone who's been liking up these, uh, Pokemon X and Y episodes, there's been, there's been a lot of support on these still, even though, like, a lot of Let's Players who like to rush through things have finished the game already, uh, like I said, I'm not trying to make the fastest Let's Play, I'm not trying to make the, the most in one day, I'm not trying to, like, make the best Let's Play, I'm just trying to have fun with it, and I really hope that you guys have fun with it too, because a lot of people ask me to do a Let's Play on this game, so, here it is, and, uh, I also want to do a Let's Play on this game, because it's a pretty sick game so far. So let's just keep going. Let's just keep going for it, dude. And freaking burn that Fletchling. People keep it. Dude. All right. I don't understand what's so good about Fletchling. Like, Fletchling seems like a pretty meh Pokemon in my opinion. But so many people keep saying, like, catch a Fletchling. I'm like, dude, I really Is it like, is it because I need a Pokemon that knows Fly or something? Because if so, I have Charizard coming my way soon. Well, soonish. But, like, dude, I don't want to catch a dumb bird. He looks stupid. He looks stupid. I want to run into a Pokemon in this grass here. Yeah, let's see. I just wanted to see what would come up. Let's see what pops up. Is this a double battle? No. What the balls? What is that? Hon, honage, honage, hon. It's a, it's a freaking sword, dude. What is this thing? Is there, is there is this on Maryland somewhere? Hon, hon, honage. It's a steel ghost type. That's pretty sick. So if we use Ember on it, it's probably gonna knock it out, eh? Let's see. Ah, it's gone. <laughs> oh well. Steel ghost type. Wow, that's weird. Oh my god. Do you guys know if that thing's good or not? Because nah, I don't think so. Two weird tires. I don't think I would consider using that very much. Even though, wait, let me think. Like things, steel's like a really strong type. So is ghost. Like normal moves don't affect ghost types. Still, uh, normal moves are sort of mech and steel types. What else, what else comes up? Anything else cool about this route? Let's see. Oh, there's a Sentret. Hey, Sentret. Good old Sentret. Sentret's the best Pokemon ever. Hey, you know what I mean? He's pretty sick. I like him. But uh, we're just going to run away from that battle. We're not even going to bother fighting that. Um, there's another trainer. Ah! What's this? What could you possibly want from me right now? Another Sentret. That's, you're cute. Don't worry. I, I still think you're cute, Sentret. Chill. Just chill out. <laughs> oh, I'm thinking about just jumping straight to the end of this route because I really don't care about anything on here. I know those new Pokemon. Oh, let's just skip past you. Jump over this. Uh, and we're back at the, uh, wait, let's just jump in this grass a little one more time. Because there might be something else. I don't know, dude. I can see that there's another Pokemon here that I don't, no, it's just a freaking, no, let's see, I'm done, dude. We're done. I don't want to see Sentrits all the time. They're just going to piss me off. Oh, well, let's, let's just jump out. I know that, uh, I know that, uh, what are they called? Venipede jump out of the sides of the bush when we walk up the thing. So, oh, here we go. There's another thing. Why are these bushes like there's so many? Is it is it just? Oh, there's another one of these things. I sort of want to catch one and see what it's like. I'm gonna click its thing on. Nah, I won't click its thing on Maryland. Um, let's just uh, get out of here. I don't care about you very much. I think it's just because he's new. I care so much about him. But now that I've sort of figured out that he sucks, I'm not gonna use him. <laughs> he doesn't chuck, Mitch. Wait, what's this? TM09 Veno Shock. So I guess that's the whole reason of us coming down. How do we go down on the on the left side? Do we have to go all the way back up? I don't care, dude. I can care less about the left side. Let's just jump out of here. I know there's some battles in here, but we can uh do those off screen, even though I like never ever do them off screen. <laughs> so we're just gonna we're just gonna walk back down Route 7 and we're gonna go back down this way and we're gonna get rid of that frick. Oh, what's this? Wait, so there's another part of this place? Is this the place? Hey. What's this? Exclamation mark. Hey, mister, this way is this way. You! I know this is an unexpected request, but I need you to take care of my berry field. What? No, I'm not just taking care of your berry field. I know that I'm a berry myself, but... I assume you love to work... Should I... No. Actually... We can't say no? 
Oh my god, dude. This is what I hate about Pokemon when we can't say no. It's like, nah, I don't want to do that. Oh, god damn, dude. Oh my god. I don't care about berries. It was a bat. I wish I could go back in the past and say, don't do it. It's just berries. Yeah, we got orange berries. Oh my god, dude. The berry part of Pokemon is like, it's something that's pretty cool. Like, look, you can plant berries here, and then if you come back a few hours later, they'll be fully green, and you can use these on your Pokemon and, and equip them, and they'll do better things in battle. But, like, it's something that I don't care about, dude. I just want to freaking battle stuff. <laughs> I want to fight stuff. I don't care about you showing, putting berries in my pants. Damn, dude. Or bag, or whatever. Is that it? And that's it. So, uh, I think we just learned about berries in this generation, but seriously... Berries are something I don't care about until I ever want to like use them. If I ever want to use them, I'll start caring about them. But no, nah, I don't. I don't care about them. All right, let's get back to Snorlax and see how he's doing. Hey, man. Hey, Sleeping Beauty. <laughs> what? Oh, it's you two. Did you manage to find the Pokeflute? Yes, I did, dude. Take it. Thanks. Play it right. Snorlax will be grumpy when he wakes up. Um. I'm ready to stop it? No. Okay, uh, I don't want to kill the Snorlax because I might actually do it. Uh, I want to save right here. Uh, this is what I always used to do in Pokemon Yellow and Fire Red and all that. I'm going to save right here, and if there's a cut in the video right now, it means I killed the Snorlax, but hopefully there isn't. So let's just go battle this guy. Um, yeah, let's fight him now. I wonder if we can actually catch this. I <sighs> We do have Great Balls on us because I remember in Pokemon Red and that. Oh, well, let's just listen to this. Oh man, <laughs> I love that song. It's so so nice and peaceful. I remember in Pokemon Yellow and, and Blue and all that uh, that you couldn't actually catch Snorlax with normal balls. Oh, he's only level fifteen. We might smash him. Let's just use Scratch. Let's see how much. Oh, he has freaking height. Snorlax. He has amazing defense and super high HP and super high attack. Snorlax is just an overall beast, dude. Let's just use Dragon Rage and see how low it gets him. Remember, he does have rest. So, oh my goodness. Do you use rest? Oh, it has a citrus berry. Alright, so one... Oh, we're going to die. Yeah, okay. So, I think one more Dragon Rage would have got him down to a catchable catch. Yeah, but uh, in um in Pokemon Blue and that, you you couldn't catch po uh, Snorlax with a freaking Pokeball. You had to use a Great Ball, which was weird. Like, the Pokeball would just bounce off his belly. I'm not even joking. Uh, let's use... Vine Whip shouldn't take him out. I'm really hoping it doesn't. Alright. Looks... It looks like he's catchable right now. Let's just try. Let's try and see what we can do. Let's go bag. How many, how many great balls do we have? Oh, we have luxury balls. All right, we have Pokeballs. I don't think we can even get great balls at this point because we only have the first gym. So if we use a Pokeball right now, which, yeah, there we go. That was just something that was weird about Pokemon Red and Blue and Yellow. And, oh, wow. Not even one wiggle, wiggle, diggle. He's going to use defense curl. I think if he gets his defense curls up and he gets his defense up a little bit more, I won't be scared of hitting him. But I'm just too scared to hit him right now and I might kill him. That was just something that was weird with Pokemon Blue and that, I guess, it's not in future generations. It would have been cool if it brushed onto this generation, like, no, you can't catch this guy without a Great Ball. Great Ball. But I don't even have a Great Ball. Exactly, you can't catch him. <laughs> One, two, three. Ooh. Oh, I hate that. Oh, man, I hate it when it does that. You're like, yes, I've caught it, but no. All right, we're going to let this guy get us down a little bit more. Hopefully, he doesn't kill us. Because uh, as soon as this... Uh, Quilladin's gone. We're, we're down to like our our fighting panda dude and uh, routes. So I don't know, dude. Let's go, Pokeball. Want to catch this time? One, two, three! <laughs> no, man! Come on. Can use special defense. All right, he's special defense. If he's because I think no, Vine Whip's just a, a regular attacking move. So if he's he gets his defense up a little bit more, I won't be scared to use Vine Whip. But I'm I, I I'm scared I won't get him down all the way to the red. I might get him past the red, which isn't what I really want right now. Oh man, let's go. I'm actually gonna use one more Vine Whip. Let's hope this this doesn't get critical or something. Oh, he's gonna use Tackle on us. Jump in the air, Snorlax. Freaking crush our little Quilladin, dude. Oh, nice, dude. That's that's just where I want him. All right, now we can go in our bag and use our poke. Wait, that Snorlax is faster than us. That Snorlax went before us, dude. Is Quilladin just like an overall slow Pokemon? Because if you're slower than a freaking fat-ass Snorlax, I, I worry about you. 
Damn, dude! Come on! I'm gonna throw a Luxury Ball at him and see if it works. Even though I'm pretty sure Luxury Ball is exactly the same, I, I'll i just... Maybe it's lucky and I get him. I don't know, dude. Let's get a Luxury Ball. I think I'm paralyzed as well. Oh, man. Hopefully the town's right after we battle this guy. Alright, come on! Freaking Black Balls. Work! One, two, three! Yes! Oh, yes! Awesome, dude. First try. Luxury balls always work, dude. It's all about them black balls. Wait, we got... Oh, yeah, that's new about this generation. You still get experience even if you catch the Pokemon. So, um, so you get a lot of experience when you catch a legendary, I guess. That's pretty sick. Nice, dude. Give a nickname to Snorlax. Nope, I have a nickname for him right now. So, um, I don't think I'm going to use Snorlax this playthrough, guys, just because Snorlax is in just about every game, and I think everyone's going to use him in this generation. So, even how, even though how overpowered he is, I'm not going to use him. Um, just because I want to see what the other Pokemon are, and I'd rather have, like, two more, like, sort of different move Pokemon than just Snorlax. Especially, I, I, I think I want two more 6th generation Pokemon on my team, unless I find something pretty cool. Uh, here's the guy with his duck dog. It's a poodle. I got told it's a poodle. It's not a duck dog. It's a poodle. So I'm sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. People are really angry at me. Like, it's a poodle, you dumb piece of dick. All right, he said something. Oh, I think we're returning the poker flip to him, which is nice. Uh, we didn't even wipe our spit off of it. So, uh, he can, he can, uh, that's disgusting, dude. <sighs> All right, let's move on to, what's this route here? And, oh, wait, what's this? Oh, man. This looks like the daycare right here. Oh, hey, Strob. Trev said he wanted to give Pokemon daycare. No! I am not going to leave a Pokemon in daycare. I, I like to train my... Actually, sometimes what I like to do... I could You couldn't do this in Pokemon Black uh, black and White. Um, but what I did was I left my Pokemon in daycare. Uh, no, well, I usually leave my Pokemon in daycare, like a Pokemon that I don't really want. I leave them in daycare, and then like at the end of the game, I come back and I'm like, Oh, you're level 100, that's nice. Um, but no, I'm not going to leave... No, nah, I'm not going to leave any Pokemon in there. Um, just because... I, I don't know about... Is it, if you leave something in daycare, it doesn't get any Eevee boosts or something. I don't know, dude. Something like that. It's not good for it. It's better just to battle them, so I'm not going to leave anything. Um, I'm actually going to keep Snorlax on our team just for the moment. He's going to be like a temporary guy on our team because if we do get a... Uh, oh, wait. What are you? Hey, I'm the daycare man. You look not as old as the daycare man should be. But what's this over here? That's a nice view of a lake. Oh, these guys seem to be painting. <laughs> are you painting something, dude? Oh, wait. What the hell? Ah, damn it! Didn't even want to battle me. It just, I just jumped in and asked for. Oh, it's a girl. Artist, nice. Oh, I knew you. I knew it. I was about to say, dude. The artists in the old games used to have schmiggles. Of course, they have a freaking schmiggle, man. And of course, we send out routes first that knows nothing. I think. Let's see. Schmiggle doesn't know anything anyway, doesn't it? Let's see. All right. Let's do. Oh, we got confusion. Let's just do that. That should do some damage. Uh oh. Critical hit. Oh, this isn't going to be good. This confusion better work good. Okay, that's pretty good. I like that. Didn't get any confused though, so I could have... I should have... I, oh, that's not good at all. We do have uh, potions for backup though, so don't worry. Oh, nice. Critical hit by routes. Not going to risk it. Let's just use a potion right here. Uh, yeah, one potion should do it. Um, what was it? Uh, we could have used double team at the start there. Maybe got like two, three double teams off. He wouldn't have been able to hit us, but meh. I do, I'm, I'm more of a person that just goes straight in for the attack just because it's more fun. Ah, dude, my foot hurts. Ow, man. Why does my foot hurt so much? Oh, crap, we got burn. Lucky we're using special attacking moves, not attacking moves because the burn halves our attack. Or does it halve our special attack as well? I don't know, dude. So many freaking questions to ask. All right. One more ember and one more burn and then this confusion should take him out. Nice, dude. Nice, dude. There we go. Gain three. Whoa. That was a lot of XP there. Routes grew level 14. I wonder what level Routes evolves at. I think it's something like... something in the, Is it something in the teens? I want to say it's something more in the... Like the, the higher... I don't know, dude. Something like in the 20s, maybe? Or I'm thinking it's in the teens. I don't know. Let's just keep on going. Let's not even bother going down. Let's like, look at this beautiful lake. A little bit more. There's a... Ah! Freaking double battle! You serious? Like, my Pokemon are so damaged right now, dude. You just have to jump me for a double battle. That's just mean. Artist, family, Mona, and Polar. That's cool. <laughs> Two Schmeagles. Alright. Let's see how we do this. We got routes, like, all the way down on zero. We might... route. We'll just let routes faint. We'll send out our uh, fighting, fighting Panda Bear. Whatever his name is. 
And uh, Quilliton can probably tank these guys. Let's see. Let's use Confusion. Wait, if we use Tele... No, we can't use Teleport in battle. Right, okay, and let's use uh, Rollout on Schmeagle. There we go. Nice. I like to go... I don't know. Some people like to do double battles differently. Some people like to target one Pokemon. I just go for two different ones because you, you never know. You might completely knock out one uh, the one guy in one move. It doesn't really matter, dude. It doesn't really matter what your double battle strategy is. I just have mine and you guys probably have your own. P Pancham, come for the rescue. Pancham could probably beat these guys. Pancham's a beast. Aren't Schmiggle's like normal types as well? So if we have one fighting move, arm thrust, exactly. Let's just use it under Schmiggle. Pancham's a freaking boss as well. So, you know, he's, he's probably going to own these guys up. Oh, he's got confusion. Yeah. Oh, no. That's not good. Oh, no, that's not good at all. All right, let's use those arm thrusts. Come on, get... Oh, yeah, are we going to get four off? Oh, no, just three. Oh, four. Five. Oh, yes, dude. That's exactly what we want. Five times, nice. Level up as well. That's doubly nice. And let's see if we can take out Karate Chop. Oh, God. Uh, let's forget. Leer, we don't need Leer. One, two, three, ta-da. We've got Leer and learn Karate Chop. And let's see what Quilladin... Oh, Quilladin levels up as well. I bet Quilladin's going to learn something as well. Let's see. No. All right, nice. I'm going to use Rollout. And I think one Karate Chop could probably take out this Schmiggle. Let's see. Fight. Karate Chop. Oh, wait. There was nothing there. <laughs> He's going to use Confusion on our Quilladin. Nice. Bam! Oh, nice, dude. There we go. And one more level up for us. Nice, dude. Panchamp's getting some sick levels here. Quillian gets some levels. Nice. All right, we beat the Artist Family. So whatever their name was. Yahoo! Um, all right, guys, we're going to have to finish off this episode of Pokemon X and Y right here just because i got to head off now. Uh, my mom, like, came in, like, halfway through. I was like, Mom, leave. <laughs> we're here at this place, whatever this place is. Um, what is this? In this building, it's called Cal Chateau. Nice, dude. This looks very British. <laughs> but, you guys, if you did enjoy this episode of Pokemon X and Y, be sure to let me, let me know with a comment and a like down below. Uh, if I did ask any questions in this episode, let me know with an answer. And uh, I think there'll be a new episode tomorrow. They're pretty sure there should be an episode tomorrow. Um, so, yes. Yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. Hey, I have to say, and I will see you whenever I see you next. Bye!